do, 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 do. Are you guys listening? Well. <laughs> not joking. Let's do this. Welcome back to my channel. Ah, this is she is short. Short is she. She is me and I'm her. Okay. Okay. No, don't pay attention to my shirt. Yeah, my shirt's a mess, but anybody got time for that? Anyway, so I'm doing a video. Listen, I have to bend down again because obviously I couldn't figure out the setup for this. We are doing a try on haul, but I'm just using my regular clothes because obviously ever that way to get this from my bruv. You about to find out. You about to look no joking but yeah so i'm looking outside the car i don't know who they think they are but i interrupt my i was gonna do the shoes i was ready for this i was gonna do the shoes in this but i've got enough shoes to do another video so i figured you know what let's just make more content because might as well oh yeah do you look at my chain look at that look at that look at that look at that i got another one for my daughter yeah it's an a and it's really cute i got it from brixton how much did i pay it's palm it's pound and then my daughter's one was like i think it was like five pound because it was just dependent but yeah look look how cute it is it's nice isn't it and it don't change color it don't nothing don't turn your neck green as well i've got it on my neck but yeah so we're just gonna try on some outfits that i picked out today because i'm feeling myself feeling myself feeling my feeling my oh yeah and don't forget to like subscribe and comment if you want you can share you know i'm not gonna ask too too much you know just work the workings but um no you're joking i'm up 26 subscriber bring it it bring it bring it bring it after the subscribers are you dumb on one of my videos i've gotten to 200 views are you dumb are you dumb are you dumb are you dumb all the love that you are giving me it has been received hey are you mad bruv I'm excited. I'm actually excited for myself. Do you know why? Because I'm never thinking to make and Do you know what it is? It's just long. Like, I always say to myself, it's long, it's long, it's long. And I actually did it. I was like, bro, I can chat for days. Like, so why not do it? Like, duh, bitch. <laughs> like, duh. But no, so, yeah. We're going to try on some clothes. And what else before we get into this video? Nothing. Oh, yeah. I'm doing this whole healthy eating thing, yeah? Because I don't like the spots on my face. Not even the spots, like the scarifications on my face. Like, I just don't like it. I don't like it. So we're going to see if... I've, I've, been, I've been detoxing. So... Oh, my Jesus Christ. And you look, couldn't tell me I have bogeys. Do you know what it is? This hay fever is a curse, you know? I was talking about hay fever all my days. It's only been like a day and a half since I've been drinking this like just lime and water or lemon and water, yeah. And when I say to you, it worked like this morning. I usually wake up because of my hay fever. Like my hay fever is my alarm clock. I chew, bitch, wake up. I chew. I know you fucking know. Like it's it's an awake like an awakening out of my own sleep. Like even when I'm not ready to wake up, because my hay fever just kicks in. That's how I wake up. This morning, me wake up when I'm ready. Yo, me wake up when me ready. Nobody never tell me nothing. Me wake up say, good morning. Me wake up when me ready. So I was like, oh, okay, calm. Say no more. Say no more. Say no more. So if you want to get rid of your hair fever, I know I take no medication, government thing, man-made thing. Then you drink some lime water. Or you can go to your, um, I don't even know, but you have to get raw honey. It can't be shop-bought honey, yeah? Get the raw thing with the actual hive in it, yeah? But it has to be from your area because the way it is, it's the pollen from your area that the bees are harvesting to make the honey, which is making your hay fever go mad. So you can't get the, the the honey cone, whatever, from like, I don't know, some next place like Brixton or fucking, I don't know, Camden, wherever. No, it has to be. Yeah, so I'm from Craydon. So I'll get the honey cone from Craydon. Do you see what I'm saying? But that's a bit expensive. You can't get line for a pound, pound fifty, or one big bowl in I market for one pound. So I'm just go down there and buy my thing. Man, I'm not even that. I'm gonna drink it raw. Sometimes I eat it so. Sometimes I put it in my water overnight, make it you know alkaline style. 
But that's what I do. And darling, <laughs> minus please. And the reason why so, yeah. I permed my hair, I'm not gonna lie to you guys. Idea. Like but, um, I love my natural hair. Love it, love it, love it. My hair is born. But with my lifestyle, look how pretty it is though. But with my lifestyle, my daughter, and my lifestyle in general, I do not have time to be deep conditioning protective stuff like, it's just long and my hair is not to that length where i can just throw open a high bun and do you know what i mean i'm still in that short category when it comes to length so and then me trying to figure out what to do with it so much my scalp is so tender and it's actually it was damaged and it was like my ends were dehydrated and trash it was just a, it was a bad situation my hair is it's not now, when my hair's at its best, it's beautiful. And I know when my hair's at its best because I can tell in the curls, the texture, everything. And my hair was not at its best. And I know I can treat my hair and deal with my hair properly when my hair's like this. I haven't permed my hair since I was 12 years old. I am now 24 years old, yeah? Just letting you know. But just have to big up my girl, Jess, because, boy, you see my Snapchat pictures? Yeah, I'm going to put some pictures in there. I'm going to put the pictures in there for you know. My little body. I look bad. Mm, I didn't take. I look bad. But anyway, let's go into this video. Okay, Rest so dress me. number one was about. Come on, chain. If you don't see some lining under there, it's my boxes. Me and change my drawers for no dress. See, I'm not going to waste, and there's no point. So, but this dress here, how much was it? About twelve pound, and it was in a shop in Craydon by my old house, and they're like an African apparel shop, but the fabric is really stretchy, kind of like that. And then the back it just zips up. But when me say, me put on the dress, because I had somewhere to go. And I got this dress and I was like, you know what, last minute thing. Like I really wanted to go. I can't remember where I was going, but I know it was that day. And I literally just shut down the road and tried to find any shop that was open last minute. And I saw the shop and I saw the dress in the window. And I was like, you know what, I have an eye for dresses that will sit on my body mad. Because my waistline is like a size six to eight biggest. My bum's a size 10 to 12. And then my top's a size eight, never changed. So, when I see a dress, the first thing I look at is this, yeah, and this one, can you see it? No problem, just hug on by my body, hug on by my body, hug on by my body, ah! No, joking, okay. but no. The dress nice, I like the dress, the dress nice. I've worn this out bare times, but excuse hair, you know, timing them up, but it's alright. But yeah, this is my dress. And it comes all the way down. I don't know if you lot can see it, but it comes like... My shirt, yeah? My shirt, okay, I'll show you. But I do like this dress, it's my favorite dress. I wear this out bare with my girlfriend, are you crazy? But yeah, so we're gonna get into dress number two. Hey, listen, this dress is a bit harder to get into. And I think this dress is a bit see-through, like this part here. I got this from H&M in Corrado. but it's a bit shorter if you can see it and yes like we said i don't like the bag in this hair because i everyone thinks i walk like this on purpose no i don't just walk down the street like this yeah i don't walk like that i've got an arch in my back so if i was to stand up straight that's what it looked like so what do you want me to walk around like so i've got something shoved up my ass i can't walk around like that i look mad so that's how i stand up like naturally so every time I buy a dress, the first thing I look upon at the waistline and this piece. If it don't sit right, pal, me no matter how pretty the dress is, it don't business. Me not buy the dress. You just could have 24 karat gold and diamond and this, this, that. Me not buy the dress. Yeah? But this one was from H&M and it was, I think it was £20. But I bought this like last year. Because I wore this for Christmas. Just gone. So I bought the dress last because I bought the dress a couple weeks before Christmas. And I was like, no, I have to wear this. I have to look good. I have to look good. But yeah, so it's nice. It's a bit tight around this area here. It's a bit, but it's not short. And if you have a little bumper, my size and up, yeah, or if you've got hips, you're going to have to keep doing this. That's what I had to do every time I walked, and then because I don't like this piece stretching out too straight, so you have like this gap here. You see that? So, what I do is like that, like that, and it's good. But if you're walking, you are gonna have to keep pulling down this dress and the other dress as well. All the hug with dresses, but never hug your body, you have to keep pulling it down. But this dress is comfortable, it's a bit 
itchy hair. But yeah, it's nice. I don't know if this is see, is it? Yeah, see, let me tell you, see true, see true. So we're black, ladies. We're black, and the other dress is not see through. The black one that I was wearing, the black and white one. But yeah, just number three. Okay, this is just number three. I had to change position because I, this is my favorite dress. Like my favorite. You can see my clothes, right? My favorite dress. Yeah. And you are not even gonna believe where I got this dress from. Yeah, I've got a thingy. You can see my boxes also. That's how tight this dress hugs me. Look, no gap gap. None of that gap gap. It sits on me perfect. Like you can't see now. Look by my ship door. Look by my ship. Look by my ship. This dress. This dress shows my true, like, slim, thick, hourglass, six pet. Look at that. Bye. Hey, listen, guess where I got the dress from? Guess where I got the dress from? Wish! Everybody's dogging Wish. I got the dress from Wish. And I'm gonna see if I can find the dress. The only wrong, like, bad thing, sorry, I'm all tab red. The only wrong thing that I can say about the, this dress, it's supposed to be a turtleneck. And as you can see, it's too wide. It's supposed to be like that. But I just wear it like this, like, middle business. Kind of just look good by me. Middle business. But let me show you the length of it again. So, I'm going to go and wish I'm fine. Because I, I bought this time ago. I bought this about, like, two, three years ago. No, that's a lie. I bought this about two years ago. Yeah? Because I was, still, I was with Rihanna at the time. Yeah. I remember buying... When, why did I buy this dress? I bought this dress, yeah. You know, you know, this year, I just want to look good for you. Guys. That's why I bought the dress. I bought the dress. And I was like, let me just pop it on. And see what she says and she likes it but so this is and the only thing if you sweat it you are gonna show like i remember wearing this dress and literally all hair i was sweating hair i was sweating hair i was sweating hair i was sweating like i you could see it's you sweat so make sure that you got like deodorant or something because this dress you will see it when you sweat but this is how long the dress is can you see how long the dress is and i do have to keep pulling it down but this is this dress is bomb, like, and this dress was like, I think it was £7 on Wish. I'm going to see if I can find it on Wish, yeah, I'm going to see if I can find it. You don't, don't believe me. When you shop on Wish, you have to make sure you know what you're doing. You First of all, you have to know your body. You have to know your body. If you don't know your body, don't go Wish. Because remember, it's dirt cheap prices for dirt cheap things, yeah? The quality is just going to be dirt cheap. So you need to know what you're looking for. Fair enough, like, all hair, all hair. But you, you can accessorise and make it nice. You know what I mean? Like, bruv, this just hugs my body, bruv. Are you crazy? So, this is what you have to do with Wish. Make sure you look at the picture. So when you go, so when you go all the way down, it shows you can buy, you can go halves with another person and buy the product cheaper. It tells you about the product, all of that, the star ratings, and then you see people's comments. Most of the time, 50-50% of the time, people leave picture evidence so you can see how it sits on their body. Yeah, if it don't sit on their body properly, yeah, or they have shape and it don't sit on, or even if they don't have shape, or even if they just it looks like it just been slapped on their body make sure you know your side make sure you know what it looks like you look like on you every girl knows like if i go to the shop and i'm and i'm not, I'm not even on shop i don't really online shop but if i was online shop now yeah and i scroll down and i see it sit like mad on some next girl yeah i'll be like okay so it's gonna sit good on me but if i see it sit like slap dash on a girl i'm gonna be like okay so i don't like that area i don't like the area i know it's not gonna sit on me no matter the shape or the size unless you got a outdone Nicki minaj body Everything will sit perfect on you, but if you don't, you need to know the flaws about it, the body size, everything. I'm telling you, Wish does wonders. I've had this dress for about two, three years now. Like, come on. Come on. And only thing me, I want my body, you know. I want my body and coupon, they just sit on me. Oh, me just fly. My panina. Bruv, the dress is banging. The dress is banging. But anyway, so just number. Four, come on up. No, I'm joking. So this is another dress. This dress is mad see-through. And I don't have any tartars. So every minute I'm going to have to be like this. And I've got a strapless bar on. So those are the flaws about the dress. I got this from Vibe in a shop called Vibe. I'm about to say something else. In Craydon. As you can tell, I don't really leave my base. So if I can get it in Craydon, then I can get it in Craydon. If I can get it on Wish, getting it on Wish. Like, eh, like 
you have to drag me out of my house for me to go shop far like far 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 i ain't been westfield in years like but yeah anyway so here's the back and this is let me show you what i'm talking about this i don't like this you see that i don't like that none of the other just had that i don't like that so i'm planning on getting this just altered because i don't like that it's mad see-through know that you can probably see my boxes under this but um the dress itself the layout of the dress is beautiful the construction of the dress for 29 pound i think it was like it's either no it was either 19 pound or 29 pound one or two but it wasn't less than that i did not get this dress for 10 pound i did not get this dress for 12.99 actually i got a tag on it should i take it off it's a size 10 I lied. I got the dress for well, okay. I got the dress for sixteen ninety nine. Yeah, but then well, because he knew that because I know who the guy is in there. Yeah, because he knows my mom. And my mom used to go in there for like the jewelry and this that that. So him knock it out for me and give me twelve ninety nine because the price was if you don't believe me sixteen ninety nine and now it's twelve ninety nine. So and I remember I told him I was like oh so you're gonna charge your your loyal customer full price and he's like what are you doing ask above you know my mom. You know what? I was like, who's that? And I was like, pick, bruv. You know my mum. Mom, like, my mum's tag is picking it because she's a head just so you know the FL call the pick. Yeah. So, so I was like, bruv, you know my mum. So I'm her daughter. So you can give me discount, bruv. And he gave me a discount. What's good? But it just was $12.99. When I bought it, it is sixteen ninety nine. But most stuff in there, sorry, I think somebody did tell the truth. Most things in there is 29 and up. Yeah. What is this, bruv? But I do not look at my girlfriend's name. What's good? What's really good? What's really good? No, I'm joking. <laughs> but the dress is nice. The only thing I don't like about it is... Well, I, I can't blame the dress. It's my body. Me not have no breasts. Yeah? And um, when the kind of bra me need for wear is stuff. Come have it. Me just need some help. Push it up. 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 Back your back. Back your back. And the thing is, yeah, if you're going to dinner, this is great. If you're going to a party, don't wear this dress. Number one, it's see-through. No matter it's short. You know what? Break your back and QQ and one drop and all them thing there. And split the knee middle. Make that too touchy. No, everyone's going to see your middle. So you might. But let me show you the length of the dress. I have to change my thingy. So it's above your knee. But as you're walking, number one, the back baggy. I know my two it just come up so you have to bring it down i like this dress knee length so at the knee not above not below at the knee i just think it looks nice but yeah this is the dress and i haven't worn this out yet hence the tag was still on the dress this is the dress uh, uh. this is the uh this is the uh no, i'm joking but yeah you can see my boxes in it. This dress is mad see-through, bruv. You better wear like one of them nude G-strings, Bacan. You're not wearing nothing underwear to this. But yeah. It's very thinny middle. I'm joking. But that's my collection. I was going to wear another dress. But. Should I wear another dress? You don't want to see another dress? Give me another dress. And this dress I got from the same place as here. So. But that dress was twenty pound. I remember that just twenty pound because I had to change the money for I got two accounts. I did it and I have a mobile app, mobile banking, whatever, and I had to transfer the money. So I remember that just twenty pound. And I went out with my girlfriend and she was feeling the dress. Everybody was feeling the dress. Ah! But yeah, I would one more dress and then yeah. <clears throat> I'm joking. So as you can tell. You need a strapless bra for this. And I don't like the... Well, I do like the dress. I just don't like the top part of the dress because I have no boobies. And just to come, make me buy this dress. Yeah? Make me buy this dress. Because we were supposed to be going somewhere. Didn't end up going. And we was all going to wear red. But this is the dress. I like the way it hugs my body. Obviously, there is no complaints, no bagginess. Like, my bum just looks nice. 
I know I haven't had my bum done, so don't ask. Yeah, my, my, my mother just blessed me, and God bless my mother for bless me, and God bless my grandmother for bless my mother for bless me, and this goes on. But I never get blessing at this area, but you can't complain once you get blessing, you get blessing. It is, isn't it? But if I had surgery, the first thing I'd do is my babies. First thing. But no. This is the thing. It's nice, I just don't like this part. That's the only thing. Even if the dress was like that, or like spaghetti strap, and then like that, like just straight, like no cut, no V line, no U line, no sweetheart neckline, nothing. Just like that, it would be better. But as you can tell, all my dresses are like, do you know what I mean? But I do like the dress. I do. But this is definitely the type of dress where you have to pull it down, especially if you want that proper printout hourglass figure. This is the dress we have to pull down. But yeah. <laughs> but oh no, my girlfriend's gonna kill me. Listen, I have a girlfriend, I've taken, I've happily taken, but I look for nobody and I'm gay. Yeah, let me just cover all those bases before my girlfriend sees it on her feed, her timeline, her YouTube feed, whatever you wanna call it. Yeah, and think say I'm trying to skin out skin. No, 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 no. I have a girlfriend. Yeah, we live together, we have a family. I am not looking for nothing. Zero, nada, don't ask, yeah. So I've already cut off the conversation before there was a conversation. I just cut it. Uh, cut it, cut it, cut it, cut it, yeah! I'm joking. But yeah. That's it. That's literally it. So, guys, let me tell you a secret. I'm going now. That's it. But, I don't really like bending down. You lot can see all my things. There you go. Hey, listen. So, the next video that I'm going to do, I was going to do the facial video first. But I figured, you know what, let me just try something different because everything on this channel is about beauty on a budget. But yeah, I'm only sticking to makeup and facial stuff. So I said, let me just try these. All my clothes are from secondhand shop. Five pound. You know all them brought down discount shop. You can get shoes for like ten pound. You can get a whole outfit for like ten pound, five pound, five pound. Those are the shops I go to. Yeah. Unless I'm going out and it's proper like, ain't gonna let a bitch try strap me. I ain't gonna let a bitch try step me. I ain't gonna let a bitch try flex on me. Don't steal my drip, mm, bitch, please. Hello, move, bruv. Don't pay rent in there, man. Are you listening? But yeah, unless it's like a proper, like, I'm that bitch chopper, I'm going out. Or if I'm going out with my girl, then it's like, you, you, you need to know, like, I'm that bitch. But I will spend money on a proper dress. But if it's not, bruv, I'm going to second hand shop. Or I'm going to, like, the five pound shop. Do you know what I mean? Like, what's the point? But yeah, that's me. Um, what was I also going to say? I'm going to do a video with my shoes. My shoes, some of them are a bit old. Some of them are new and I have not even worn them. Like, there's one that I bought from Primark specifically to wear on a night out. Did not wear them and I still haven't worn them. Um, one, two, um, three. And I wore those. So, that two and a half, maybe three. I wore one, yeah, for it's 60 pound shoes and I wore them like twice. But anyway, so I'm going to do that and then after. I will do the facial thing, the facial video of all my gadgets and stuff. I just want to give like the face part of the beauty section a bit of a break and then do the shoes. I'll do the shoes and then I'm going to show you how I style my lovely newfound poem here. And then um, we'll do it like that. Do a video, do a video, video. And then, yeah, that's about it, guys. I need to go and wash my face because I don't know why I'll go with my life story, but this is not it. But, yeah, I need to hurry up and do that so when my girlfriend comes back, I look cute because we can't be doing this. We can't be doing this. But, guys, make sure you add up my Instagram and my Snapchat. My Instagram is she is cute. Duh. Oh, yeah, my Snapchat is I am underscore cute. But you spell cute. C-U-T number three. Yeah, and it comes up as she's sharp yeah but other than that i love all my instagrams stay posted and i love you i'll see you with another video bye guys <laughs>